Okay, um, I've installed the RAM and the CPU. Um, I'm gonna do the fan um, while I'm recording so you can understand uh, some, a bit of an easy way to do it. Um, now with installing the RAM, if you have dual or triple channel RAM, sometimes the motherboards don't exactly label you know, where you gotta have it and all that stuff. The whole point of having dual channel RAM is to utilize the two channels. So what you do, you just look in your manual and you get to this part here. And see here it says three modules, so that's how many I've got here. It wants you to fill up the first slot, the third and the fourth. Well, that would be the third, third in theory, but I know from this diagram that that's what they want to fill up. Right next to the slots it will have that, that name, that name, or that name. So you've got to fill up those ones as it says to get your triple channel memory to work. Now, what I'll do... Um, Bring this box over so I can come around. Um, I don't know if you can see that. Maybe I'll just put it here. Mm. Um, Alright, here we go. I think that, that might work. Alright, the main thing you need to do is just hear the click. So, first of all, you want to take, you just want to take out that little, this little clip here. Um, you want to make sure the cables aren't, aren't jamming the fan, so just get them away from the fan so it, so it spins nice and freely. Okay, now first thing you got to do is locate where the CPU fan header is on the motherboard. So my fan header is um, right there. Yeah. So you would look at the fan and you'd say, all right, fair enough. A little bit of cable coming out just here. So you lightly place it on the motherboard, just lightly. Like that. Let's get some orientation up in here. Lightly place it on the motherboard, don't push it down, and see if without unhooking it from the sides, if it will fit into the plug. So, there we go, we click down. We don't have to take the plug off anywhere here, so we don't have to have a cable floating around and all that crap. So, once that's in, we will... I'll try and do this so you can see. Pick up, we'll pick up the board just like this, and you'll press in a diagonal state. So you'll go that one and that one at the same time. You get your hands behind there until you hear a click. All right, now get your hands behind this one in the corner, push, there's a click. All right, this, this corner just here, there's a click. It's quite a high pitch click. You don't want that first and initial click. You want this. You want that really high pitch one. We'll try and get it here. Not, not that one. That one. And then your CPU fan is locked in. You do not need to spin any of these here. Any of these. Just leave them hell out. And that's it. That's how you would do it.